right, so I'm just kind of doing a rapid fire set of 3D dot game heroes, and I'm not sure why. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, don't do that thing where you fall and break because I don't have another microphone. Okay. So yeah, um, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna do uh, let's play 3D dot game heroes episode 14. And where are we going? We're going to the Water Temple. So if we look down in our map, we will see that the Water Temple is down to the south. And I'm wondering then. How do I get there? I have a couple of ideas for the how of it, but I think that I probably need to go to the left. So we're about to check out some new areas, and even if I'm wrong, we're still exploring. We're still learning about our environment, about the world around us. The world of the land and the kingdom of Dotnia. Welcome to the world of tomorrow. Okay, so let's... All right, you know what? There are times that the, the whole thing is not actually faster. And in fact, it occurs to me that, uh, you know, it would be nice to actually unequip the sword. I wonder if I can unequip my sword and just run. You could do that. Uh, well, actually, no. Could you do that in Zelda? I don't remember. I know in uh, Link's Awakening, uh, you could actually kind of have, like, this sort of ultimate control about, like, which slot in your inventory was even what, what thing. I really like that. I wonder if there are coins that are higher values than just like the one and the ten. Unless I've been seeing them. Like there's probably like, alright, so it's probably bronze, gold, and, and silver. And I just never noticed like the golds. Or they're like super rare or something. Alright, like, well that was like definitely a bronze, I think. Of course that would have meant that I'd have to pay attention. Alright, so. Alright, silver's ten. Maybe like... You know, yeah, because you know what? In The Legend of Zelda, you had the rupees and there were different colors, right? There were like the greens and the greens were super common. And I want to say then there was yellow and then there was red. Okay, so what is this? This was the first dungeon, right? Wait, I don't... Okay, yeah. So that's the first dungeon. Obviously, we don't go there right now. Um, Was there anything cool here? No, maybe not. The joy of rediscovery. Let's see here. Okay. I'm loving this sword. It's supposedly wider too, right? No, no, the beam's more powered up though. So, that's really cool. And, well, you know what we'll do when we do our next dungeon? Um, we'll save all that money and we'll just do one kind of like huge sword upgrade party. I'll be excited for that. I know I want a better sword. Or, you know, like, at least a more optimal sword. That would be, like, nice. Okay. Welcome to this place. I haven't seen it yet. I do like the music, though. It's a shame, actually, that I don't get to go back to that lost forest. Or, at least if I do, I know nothing about it. Oh, look at that. These, oh, these guys actually pay to kill. I got a sword max. Oh, wow. That, that was, like, short and weird and chubby there for a moment. Hey, do you notice how my pixels are all weird now? Interesting. I like my little tail wag. I enjoy being poochy. Nah. No. No. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's good. Okay. I should keep an eye out for things exactly like that. But I never took the time. Or, actually, I don't think at the time I realized I could blow those up. So now I do. Now I know I can do it. I think I'm going to do some more Dark Souls after this. It's a secret to everybody. And what do I get? Got 100 Gs. Okay. Now, I noticed this here. Is there, is there any advantage to... Uh, should I try that? Okay, well, you know, there's some kind of pattern going on here. There's symbols, too. So there's two rooms. I think the first one looks like a percentage sign, and then that. So I wonder if those four symbols... Wait a second. No. I don't know what I was thinking. Like, you know, it was going to be on the coin or something. What's this way? I see some object blocking the way, but I can't tell what kind of object that is. Oh, well. It's not even an object. It's a treasure chest that we got earlier. I hate to say it, but at a certain point, it's it's so possible to 
kind of get lost in the fact that you're you've been all these places no okay uh, you've been all these places and you don't know or don't remember aha there we go that was the magic bullet as far as where i couldn't get before so i hope this doesn't turn into another uh cluster fudge sickle of like getting lost but you know as long as it's not those conveyor belts of sand i think i'm gonna be okay all right so now we're in truly uncharted territories looks like some kind of a zombie thing zombies in the desert and they move fast right so these are like 28 weeks 28 days later zombies and they're not your average zombies they have a little bit of pep a lot of pep he looked at anyway so what are we doing uh we're gonna go no Oh, no, never mind. I didn't see that. How does that, how does that even make sense? How did I just not see those stairs? Okay. Oh, another bomb place. Ooh, and another classic sound effect opportunity. So, very cool. I am absolutely down for getting more heart shards or whatever. Or maybe this is like a new sword. Like, maybe I got the... Oh, it's just a place to heal, isn't it? I mean, that's valuable. I guess, uh, but I mean, at this point, I bought that. Um, I did. I spent two thousand rupees on that because I guess I just didn't know what to do with my money. Like I got the sales pitch or something, and you know, oh yeah, totally. You know, the tent, super useful, and I, I have used it. I just haven't used it maybe as much as would like warrant the cost. I'd like to I'd like to kind of offset. The, okay, so there's whoops. I don't know what I did. I decided to poop out a bomb at like the worst time. That's explosive diarrhea or something. That's not really funny. It's like, oh my gosh, did you see how much life that took? Holy cow. All right. Yeah, we're gonna tent here. I hope I don't come to regret this. It'd be ridiculous if I came to regret it. But wow. All right, so those zombies, that's terrifying. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna save by pressing the correct button, which is the start button and not the triangle button for which, you know, I've, I've been playing too much of uh, Enchanted Arms or something, right? I think that I press triangle to do everything. Go into a menu, um, you know, each button here though, it does a different thing. To me, I'm just, I just care about doing the thing. Oh yeah! That was, I think, that, that sort of conceptual goal that I've been curious about. <laughs> Okay, well, we can't go there yet, because I know of still no way to do that. I'm presuming I burn the bushes. So, clearly, I don't get to go to the graveyard. You know, it's a big bummer, right? Oh, man, no more undead for me. Gee whiz, that's just awful. Wait. I could have sworn. Wasn't there? Well, then where do I go? What? What? Uh, yeah, yeah. So this is a let's play. This is not a walkthrough. Big difference. What's the big difference? Well, in a walkthrough, they actually tell you how to get places. In a let's play, I'm just let's playing it. We're playing it together. We're discovering it. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, okay, my Dark Souls 2 uh, video has got, like, a little bit of panache to it. Um, that's, you know, it is because I know where I'm going, but I'm also not, like, a perfect player. And, I mean, you know, you might watch me there and be like, oh, man, you're so skilled or something, right? Or, actually, maybe I'm just full of it and I'm just terrible at the game and I don't know. Like, no one's had the heart to tell me, oh, man, Carl, you suck at Dark Souls 2. I can't believe you think you're good. Um... Okay, so this is not the way for me to go at the moment, and I hate that. I really do. I do love all the the, the, the nice shiny coins I'm getting out of these enemies, though. Give me warm, give me smooth, give me soft, give me silky. Ah, yeah, I'm just, it's too big. It's like the sword's just too big to kind of reliably do that. All right, so cool. We went up that way. We blew up the thing. Get rid of the centaurs. 
You know, and at a certain point, I wonder, are they just defending themselves? Like, do they see me blowing up these other enemies? And they're not even enemies, you know, maybe, right? Like, maybe they're just, like, part of the wildlife. Like, this guy is, like, some awesome, amazing person, and I'm just, like, this horrible, cruel monster of a dog with a big, giant yellow sword. I did always used to think that it, it was almost, like, presumptuous to assume that, like, the Goombas were, were bad guys in, like, Mario. Um, now, I mean, you know, the original Mario. I had the instruction booklet, and I read it, and it's... Okay, all right, cool, but what evidence do I have that they're bad? I only have evidence that they walk left and right, and that's the entirety of their existence. Like, I don't think I would ever classify anything that just walked left and right to be bad. Whoa, whoa, what's this? Whimper? Me understand animals. Her dog is hungry. Sad. Give him food. Me nice person. I remember this place vaguely then. I did visit it, and this was, yeah, the second inn. I'm a geologist. -ess. Plus three, da da da. No, no, don't need room. Please come again. Thank you. Come again. Like, uh, you know, Apu Nahasapima Pedalon from, like, uh, The Simpsons. He's a fun character. Maybe a little bit racist, but, you know, he's still a fun character. Ooh, you know what? I want more Win Wings, though. Go ahead and give me the five pack, sir. Yep. Nope. At this point, fast travel, totally what I want to do. All right, yep, Wind Sage is out. Now, how did I, okay. Block defense. Okay, so there's different block games, and, and I guess block defense and block out. So wait, block defense, what would that be, like tower defense? Like a tower defense game, maybe? Oh, cool, here we go. Here's places we can go and like uh, mercilessly destroy uh, the wildlife. Like the terrible people that we are. And I like that actually like uh, my sword. Well, okay, there's the left and there's the right. Okay, so I think in order to, uh, to move forward, I need to go this way. Yes. This looks promising. This looks like what I would call the right way in the context of this game. And see, look at all the new areas we see now. And a gold coin. I love these gold coins. I've absolutely needed like a ton of rupees. All right. Yep, yep, yep. Ah, there we go. Cool. Too cool. We're making some. Uh, yeah, there is a lot of satisfaction actually involved in going these different ways. Oh, man. And we're going to have a heck of an upgrade episode then. I'm really happy about that. Oh, and this is an area I've never seen. Now, I kind of think I'm going the wrong way, though. But I'm just kind of rolling with it as well. Hey, hey, what's this? Lego block? Aw, oh, you took away my big awesome sword of awesomeness. How dare you, I guess. There's got to be a point in going this way. Like, there's got to be a reason why I'm going this direction. And maybe we'll find somewhere else we can warp to, or even a new village. That would be cool. More NPCs, more opportunities to buy things and to, to, you know, do quests. Oh, man, that 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 uh, little grave area thing, that just saved the heck out of... Ooh, treasure chest. So, whoop, so happy about that. More Legos. You know, I haven't gotten a trophy in a while, though. That would be nice. All right, so I get to look over the area and, and, and wonder about it a little bit. I still don't want to go there. Like, I'm pretty sure that I'll just die, like, so bad that I, I will be like, why did I decide to do this? And and I won't have a good answer. You know, curiosity, sure. Right, but curiosity did something to the cat. I hate that phrase, actually. Let me tell you why I hate that phrase. That phrase gives people the notion that 
that curiosity is bad, right? That you, one should not ch choose to venture into something unknown. Well, how else are we supposed to grow, right? How are we supposed to become better and, and more than what we are if we are always hiding behind what we know? Like, if I did that, I wouldn't be doing this. And if I did that, I would not be, you know, where I am in life. And I'm not actually in a perfect spot in life, so, well, that might sound like, okay, well, geez, if you're not in a perfect spot, like, that's really bad advice. Maybe, but is there such a thing as perfect, right? Is there literally the perfect way to do anything? And I, I don't think so. I think that my goal in life is not to get things right, but it's to get things less wrong. Um, so it's an iterative, kind of continuous self-improvement philosophy. And, you know, there's, there's never... Wait... Uh, ah, oh, I didn't see it. It was hiding in the shadow. Silly lighting effects. Now, supposedly, there was some claim uh, that the game made that I could change camera angles or something. Now, I've never seen it, but if I can put this in, a, like, a traditional view for a while and play like that, that'd be really cool. Like, like a pure top-down, or, like, even to the point where, like, maybe it would blur the pixel, Not blur the pixels. I don't want them to blur the pixels. I don't want to lose, you know, quality of, of the image. But if it actually can be presented in 2D, like that intro sequence, that would be amazing. Uh, are any of these, like, blow upable? I don't really have bombs to spare. That's probably a terrible idea. I should have just done one as, like, a test. Let me, let me, uh, make this the episode that shows you how good I am at wasting resources. Uh, actually, except I like to think that I'm not. Um, but, you know, it's it's never good to lie to yourself, so... Alright, let's go to the left. Okay, that's how we get out of this place. And that's how we don't get any further. So that is definitely a dungeon. That may, in fact, be the next dungeon. So we have an idea of how to get there. Too bad I don't extend my shield out as I do that, but I guess I'd be a little too cheap, right? Okay. All right, Poochie. I think that we can make it to the water temple area. I think what we have to do is we have to go up and over to the right and then down, and I can't remember which junction I think that that needs to happen, but okay. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, okay. There's just enough... There's just enough complexity to wonder where I need to go. I don't see a way out of here. It's not obvious to me. Oh! Uh, oops. Uh, I didn't realize I could go that way. I'm sure I came that way at some point, but that's okay. It all just looks like blocks to me. You and your pixelated graphics. Oh, you. Oh, you. No! Oh, I almost got cool beam sword, too. Was this the right way? I think this is closer to the... Yeah. All right, so we got, like, moblins again. I'm actually having a heck of a lot of fun with this game, though. actually getting kind of late here oh my gosh it's uh it's oh well, yeah no it's 9 uh 9 34 p.m on saturday the 19th 2015 right so presuming i'm still doing this in a year or two or 27 thousand billion years later i don't know uh hopefully i'll have actually uh acquired wait 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 was this a new area No, it's not. Okay, that's okay. Well, that's actually even that's that's better than okay. That's that's optimal. That's ideal. That's we've got beam sword power now, baby. All right, so I just need to be quick about my shield though, so I don't actually like lose the beam sword. So, 
Actually, should my presumption be... All right, my presumption should be that I should go this way. I think. I, I think? No. Getting this hardcore, like, Ninja Turtles vibe a little bit from the music. Like the, uh, the NES one. I'm not feeling like I know exactly where to go. So let's try this way. I don't think we went this way. Yes, yes! Get the squirrely little ba bandit! Wait, did I go this way? Didn't I just come from this way? There's gotta be some kind of indicator of like the right way, right? All right, so this is still nowhere near as annoying as as what the um Wait, wait, what is this? Don't look on the back of this sign. Uh, how even would I do this, actually? Yeah. Wait a second. I don't know what that does yet though. It's gotta do something, like, cause I think each one pretty much is, is something to do with like, how you can use it in the environment to like, uh, to advance. All right, so this all looks new. I'm pretty sure I didn't go this way. No, I didn't. Yes, another one of those things. Ah, really? He ran away. I was hoping to get like, you know, I'd hope, hope to get those 10, although I don't even remember where the guy is to turn it in. Yeah. Actually, the reflect magic one, no, that just helped me survive, like, the little wizard guys. It's really hard to keep track of all the darn, 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 darn places I'm going, though. Okay. All right. I do see a way to go to the water temple area, I think. But I also then see a way to go to places that I've never been before. So how do I, I don't know. How do I have the, the... Oh! All right, well, I've been that way, though. I've been that way. So I have gone close to the right way and just, just really just took it. Ah, okay. I just took it the wrong, the wrong way. What does this do? Does this hurt you at all? Oh, cool. Yeah, it's like this nice little AOE spell. Oh, it also seems to eat a lot of magic. I, I just noticed that I've barely got any magic left. Okay. All right, so there's a little tree there. Oh, it's a bomb area. Dang, that's the bomb, yo. All right, cool. Oh, it's another well. We can throw money down there. Yeah, it's a deep well. How much money am I throwing in there though? 11.85? I was just still throwing 20 rupees in, so that's not bad. Got a sunstone, that's okay. I'm waiting for like the super awesome rare item, green apple. Green apples are worth it actually because I'm almost out of magic. Got one G, awesome. Yes, what is that? Got an empty bottle. You know what? Yes. Now, may, I probably got like the one really good item. I, my suspicion is that there's one really good item in each well. Um, in, in which case I might be wasting time then. All right, so let's go ahead and let's, whoops, let's poop out a bomb. Uh, you know, it's funny, too, because I'm a dog, and it's like I'm letting out a stink bomb or something, right? Oh, all right, so so does this, like, blow up? 
No, it doesn't. That means that I've literally gone to another dead end and that I'm actually not making the progress that I believe that I am. Oh, wait, 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 no, but I just need to get to those poles. How do I get to those poles? I go... How, how do I know where to go, actually? All right, it's gotta be... Oh. Oh, shoot. I am actually not clear on the where I need to go. Okay, let's try this here. All right, now. Wait, what? Okay, no, 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 no. I'm back to that area again. So like that area was not the right, it wasn't the right way, was it? <sighs> Sir Sainé. Oh. oh, you game, you. Why do you have to be so obtuse about where I'm going? It would be nice to hit the dungeon so I had a place to warp to. I'm pretty sure. Okay. I don't think I've been this way. This looks promising that that looked promising till what could I possibly be missing all right well let's look at my overall map where am I on the overall map I am like not not even I'm at the bottom of the world map like what could possibly be here then I'm at the bottom of the world map. All there is to go is left. And left was that way. Oh no, okay. Yes. No, no, no happy. Bad, bad, bad. Blarg. I think I need to get up there so I can just, okay, so how would I get up there? If you were a sadistic game developer, how would you do this? That's all I need. I need to get in that frame of mind, right? If I'm a, just a really, I, I want people to suffer by playing my game. I need to think about this. No, 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 no. I'm starting to think that these videos could end up boring. Maybe I need to start like narrating in Spanish, right? Like, ah, uh, you know, bienvenido. Vamos a jugar 3D Dot Heroes. Uno videojuego para la PlayStation 3. Or, you know, PlayStation 3 or whatever. Ugh. Like, I could do that, you know? Like, you know, oh, Dios mío, que me estoy diciendo? Wait, what? What am I saying? Ha <laughs> ha. Wait, what am I saying to myself? Well, you know, I guess that's true. No, my goshness. Look at that. There's just insult to injury. They were just going to shoot where you were. That's okay. Look at all the coins we had that we get to keep because this game is actually reasonable. Oh, dear. Oh, my gosh. Do you see all the zombies that it spawns me near? Because of my checkpoint. I'm a, I'm a dumb person. Can't believe this. This is ridiculous. No. No. Look at you. Oh, do you see how many things it takes? No, no, no. Okay. Wait, so is this a way? That's a way out. I'm starting to think that uh, this video is getting a little long, so if I don't get somewhere soon, I'm gonna end it and uh, I may look up where I need to go. I'll be honest with you. Uh, because I kind of want to kick something else off soon. Um, wait, what? Okay. Just want to get out of here. A lot of backtracking. A lot of going the wrong direction to go the right direction. <coughs> <coughs> and not enough signposts. 
I really want more signposts. No, that's right. There's like the, the tree thing there, and I can't go any further, and that's why I never go that way. 